All right, so here it is, my official start to my vacation to go see Justin Jamie in Michigan. Here I go. Let's go through the itinerary real quick. I got about an hour and a half, close to two hour drive to get me to the airport. Well, actually, I'm gonna go park down at Crystal's uncle's house, and then I'm gonna catch an Uber for the first time, which will be really cool, because I've never been on Uber before, so I hope I have that app all situated, because I'm gonna take one of those to the airport. You then should stash some channel cards in the back seat of the Uber. Done. I will definitely <laughs> I will definitely do that so later on he has to clean it out. Like, what is this? I remember that asshole. All these thumbs all these thumb discs down and everywhere on all my videos. Um then I have to wait a little bit until my flight leaves at eleven fifty at night. Then I take a four hour flight. Well, four hours, which will get me there at like seven o'clock their time because of the time change. And Jess and Jamie will be there to pick me up. It's gonna be a long adventure because after I get in the car with them, we have another four hour drive to get to their house because they live where country mouse people live. So <laughs> That's a lot of travel. That is a lot of travel tonight. Oh my gosh, where are you? There you are. Yes, we, we recognize you. You can't know, you can't go outside. Are you excited for me to go? I will miss you. I'm excited for quiet house. Quiet and clean house. I'm gonna clean the house and it's gonna stay like that for a whole <laughs> week because there's no and, boys here to mess it up. And you're gonna play The Sims. Maybe, I might. And oh watch murder God. shows. And watch mur all the murder shows because oh Crystal loves her murder shows. So uh, off we go. I'll miss you. Oh, I'll miss you. I don't know if Have I'll fun. miss you or not. You'll miss him. He's already starting to panic because the suitcase is out. He's been really clingy. Right. Yeah, but I'm not going anywhere. You know who I'm not going to miss? <laughs> Squawky you have, McSquawk you Box have over five there. five days of no cats. Yes, but big dogs. And that's what I'm really excited to see. I'm excited to finally see the dogs. I have so many questions for them. So many questions for Like dogs. what? Give me one. Like, what's it like being in the videos? Do you like being in the videos? What's your favorite toy? What's your favorite thing to eat? What's your favorite pastime activity? What's your favorite color? Which one do you like the best? I'm gonna have to ask Oakley, like, which one of these two do you like the best? Like, I know they've gotta have a favorite. Things like that. You really have a lot of questions for them. I do. So, uh, off we go. <laughs> We're gone to the snow docks. Alright, so I made it to LAX airport. Oh my gosh, it is just madness here. There's this line that goes on forever, all the way as far as you can see. I have no idea what line it is, but I have a feeling that I have to wait in this line. I'm gonna have to go ask somebody, but I don't mind. I'm super excited and I'm early, so look at this, watch. It goes all the way back. I don't know what the line's for, but we'll find out. Alright, so this line is to check bags. It goes back as far as you can see. Let's see how far it goes. Now that's, that's a line. All I had to do was pack a bag that was one size smaller and I wouldn't have had to go through this. But here I am. At this point, I'm wondering if the two hour early that I am is enough time to check in. Wow. All right, so after about an hour of waiting in line, at least an hour, maybe an hour and a half, I finally made it. But they already started boarding, but I don't care. I have just enough time to drink a beer and get to my flight. So here's to a uh, drunken flight. Dang, those prices though, right? Somehow I have to wedge myself in between here. Alright, so I finally made it off the plane. Look, you can see my breath because it's really cold here. It was a pretty, uh, pretty quick trip. Now, to go find my ride, well, Jess and Jamie, who are probably downstairs parked somewhere. I also have to get my bags too. Check that out. Dude, we totally gotta ride that. Where's it going? It's like the monorail from Disneyland. I wonder if it takes one big loop all around here. Now I have no, I really have no idea. Where awesome food, I'm bro. Going. Thanks. All right. I, yeah, so um, maybe if I stand here long enough, they'll find me. I think I have to at some point find baggage. So that's the next, that's the next thing. I feel like I've been walking for like 10 minutes now. This airport's super huge with these little runway things. So rad. They make you feel like you're walking super fast. Still looking for the baggage claim. It's got to be around here somewhere. Everybody's kind of giving me a bunch of weird looks. I guess they don't have Mohawks out here in the Midwest. That's what this is, or the East Coast. And by the way, Christmas is over. Take down your tree. Yeah, they don't even know you're here yet. <laughs> no, it's okay. So a couple hours later, 
and we have made it to Tim Hortons. And as you guys know, that has been on my bucket list for a lot of years. Can you see the sign up there? Look, Chris hey, is here. I am cold. <laughs> I am cold, but it oddly feels really good. <laughs> it's I refreshing. Didn't dress warm for the occasion. Yeah. <laughs> but. I, know, I got my boots on. Nice. Let's go get some Timbits. Look at all the things that are in here. This is so much cooler than any donut store that I've ever been to. I think I'm gonna buy three, the last three of these. No, you're not. So Jess gets none. I stole Dan's camera. We're creeping on Dan. We stole his camera. That's his camera. Okay, so like five hours after I've landed, three, two hours after Tim Hortons, I have finally made it to the house. And look, there's real snow, and I need to get some snowshoes because that's not gonna fly. Oh, look at the paw prints. This is for sure the most snow I've been in. Maybe I was in snow like this once in my life, but this is awesome. Finally able to see their house in 3D. It's really quiet out here, it's really pretty. Let's go inside to eat the dogs. Hi! Hey, doggies. Oh, you're so cold and happy. Hey, Oakley. You're not jumping out there. Memphis is are like, Memphis is like, oh, hey. Oh, I love people. I love people too. Let's all be excited together. <laughs> Even Stephanie's excited. Oh, you're so soft. Oh my gosh. What you are so Tell soft. Like, I don't know what this is. Oh yeah, that's. <laughs> Oh, you're so pretty. Hi, my best. Yes, and I'm instantly here. covered in hair. That's about all it takes. Oh, they're so soft. Well, hi, honey. We're hi. Home. You're pretty. Memphis is like, okay, just pet me oh. and only me because I'm the only one that matters. You're so soft. <laughs> this is great. Hi, <laughs> baby. So he's like, hmm. For all the fans out there, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> right? all the hugs, you guys. All the, all the hugs. Oh, hi. that's it. She's yours for life now. She's oh, never so gonna soft. leave you alone. That's all she ever wants. She's like, no, you can't stop. That's not fair. Oh, what? Yeah, I'm sure are pretty. Yeah, you tell me all about it. She's like, I'll get pets as soon as the rest of the dogs aren't jumping in. Yeah. <laughs> this is great. And then they're like, all right, cookies. That's it. <laughs> That took all of like two minutes to get full of dog love. Memphis! <laughs> you are excitable. Memphis! Is it time to find Squirrel Friend? Hi, Oakley. That was pretty rad, I won't lie. Hi. Yeah. Oh, you're not getting enough attention either? Alright, so I'm out in front of Take 5 Deli, which is one of the things I really wanted to come do when I was here because a couple years ago I saw uh, Sarah and Yuri here and I was like man I really wish I could go to the deli and like hang out and stuff like that and I always thought it was just a dream and here I am in front dreams, of the deli. Dreams do come true. Did I dream big or? So I'm gonna go in there and eat whatever uh, she tells me to eat. <laughs> and in case you guys never seen it in the vlogs because I've never seen it this is what it looks like across the street from the deli. It's pretty nice actually. All right, so Greg totally hooked up the food. I don't know what it is, but it looks super, super good. Do you want to know what it is? Uh, sure. It's a TBT. That explains everything. <laughs> All right, so we might have overdone it a little bit on the sled buying and the shoes and the gloves and the hand warmer buying, but you know. It was you... on sale. It was on sale, how can we go pass it up? So now we have enough things to go sledding in when we go sledding, which will probably be tomorrow because I think we're getting a little delirious on not having any sleep. <laughs> I think. There's a pillow in here. Oh, there's a snow mound there. Let's go. Let's go down the snow mound. Good. Let's do it. Go right ahead. You're gonna go sled down the snow mound. You left this recording. I kind of committed to. I think I have to now. Huh? Okay, and that's right, up to you. Okay. You stay here. Okay. I'm gonna go down the snow. Mound. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to ice, Dan. <laughs> uh, he's crazy. I didn't tell him to do it. He did it on his own. How do you do it? 
Just go down the hill. That's ice, down. Dan. I gotta slow down. Slow down. Yeah, that's ice, Dan. Welcome to ice. This is the best. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Okay. Go! So I finally got all the appropriate things to be in the snow with. Now it's time to hang out here with the dogs. What do we do when we're out here? Tell me, show me. What do we do? We just, we just walk around? They get around the snow so easy and I'm just kind of like lumbering around here. Like, uh, uh, uh. Shelby. What's up? Do you have a toy or something for out here? What about you, Memphis? Nope. Hey, how about you, Shelby? You gonna play with me? I gotta watch out with these trees because the sticks get stuck in my hair. What do you guys think's in the secret barn? How come they listen to you just fine? I tried to run around to see if they'd chase me, and they sure did not want to chase me. Wait, this is very inappropriate. We're not doing this correctly? Well, should I not be videotaping this then? Just in the yard. Hey, let's go this way. You're just gonna get a bunch of comments. You know, you should have let your dogs, like, be hooked like that to the hard ass. She's like, I don't is it good for your dog to eat that treat you just made in your snack video? Here, stand on the floor. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Well, we're kind of off. We're kind of going like one mile an hour. Hey, aren't you cold? No. Should I be? Well, yeah, you're in the snow. She's like, there's too many dogs, and I'm not really sure. No one want to do anything. They're lazy. Hike. Gone to the lazy dogs. No, it's not happening. Not happening. I feel like when you try to push start a car up the street and it just does not, and it just does not want to go. <laughs> She's done looking, get it off of me. She's like, nope. Get it off of me. Fair enough. <laughs> so for dinner tonight, we got some sort of, I don't know, Alpina Strange. This is a BLT, BLT pizza. And that looks like just like a regular pizza like the turtles would get, but this one here, is like a BLT pizza, so I don't know. That it, it, it smells good. I'm sure it's gonna be good, but who thinks of these things? I also heard rumor about them putting ranch on pizza, but I don't know. <laughs> I think, with bacon and ham. I think they're just messing with me. Oh, I don't man. think that's that's you true. And finally, before bed, there's donuts, which I did not get the report back on the likings or dislikings of the Tim Hortons experience. Tim Hortons, <laughs> the donut that I had. What did I have? Some honey cooler. Yeah. It sucked. But I know that's not, you know, representative of all Tim Hortons because you brought me Tim Bits and those were good. Yeah. So we're gonna get down on some Tim Horton donuts. Oh god. And that's... finish watching Cannibal the Musical. And we're gonna go to bed. So that's it for day one of our trip. Enjoy the background music and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. So everybody have a good night and I'll see you tomorrow.